All right, so in this problem, I have x minus 4 to the power of 4 is equal to x to the power of 4. So to solve this, I'm going to first start by rewriting this as x minus 4 to the power of 2 times 2 is equal to x to the power of 2 times 2. And now, if I have something in the form a to the power of m times n, this is the same thing as a to the power of m to the power of n. So x minus 4 to the power of 2 times 2, I can write that as x minus 4 to the power of 2 to the power of 2, which is equal to x to the power of 2 to the power of 2. Now I'm going to subtract x to the power of 2 to the power of 2 on both sides. So these two cancel out, and then I get x minus 4 squared to the power of 2 minus x squared to the power of 2 is equal to 0. Now, if I have something in the form a squared minus b squared, this is equal to a plus b times a minus b. So in this case, a is equal to x minus 4 squared, and b is equal to x squared. So I get x minus 4 squared plus x squared times x minus 4 squared minus x squared. And this is equal to 0. Now from here, I'm going to expand this. So x minus 4 squared This expands to x plus 4 times x minus 4, which is equal to x squared minus 8x plus 16. So, I get x squared minus 8x plus 16 minus x squared times x squared minus 8x plus 16 plus x squared, and this is equal to 0. Now from here, let me simplify this. So x squared and negative x squared, those two cancel out, so I get negative 8x plus 16 times x squared plus x squared is 2x squared minus ax plus 16 is equal to 0. So now this gives me two equations. I get negative 8x plus 16 is equal to 0, and I get 2x squared minus ax plus 16 is equal to 0. So for negative 8x plus 16 is equal to 0, I can add 8x on both sides. So then these two cancel out, and I get ax is equal to 16. Now if I divide both sides by 8, these two cancel out, and I get x is equal to 16 divided by 8, which is equal to 2. Now, for 2x squared minus 8x plus 16 is equal to 0, I'm going to divide both sides by 2. So then 2x squared divided by 2 is x squared. Negative 8x divided by 2 is negative 4x. And 16 divided by 2 is 8. So I have this is equal to 0. Now, if I have something in the form negative b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a, this is the quadratic formula. And we're going to use this to factor this out. So in this case, a is 1, b is negative 4, and c is 8. So I get x is equal to negative of negative 4 plus or minus the square root of b squared, which is negative 4 squared, which is 16, minus 4 times a, which is 1, times c, which is 8, all over 2a. So 2 times 1. And this turns into positive 4 plus or minus the square root of 16 minus 32 over 2 which is equal to 4 plus or minus the square root of negative 16 over 2. And the square root of negative 16 is the same thing as the square root of 16 times the square root of negative 1. And if you guys already didn't know, the square root of negative 1 is equal to the imaginary number i. So I get 4 plus or minus the square root of 16 i over 2, which is equal to 4 plus or minus 4 i over 2, which is equal to 2 plus or minus 2 i. So these are my three solutions to this problem.